it's me. I'm finally back. I have time to do videos, so I'm going to be doing a lot more videos. Well, as much as I can. Uh, I'm going to do... Uh, I'm not going to do a wash video because I'm still experimenting with the shampoo and conditioner that I'm using. I wanted to do um, how I prepare my hair for the night before and then when I wake up, how it looks after I put it in the bonnet all night. So, I'm going to take a shower and I'm going to wash my hair to be ready for y'all. If you're interested in more videos like this, please let me know. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you want more and you want to stay updated with all the videos that I post, please subscribe. Thank you so much. Let's get this show on the road. So I'm I'm out of the shower and my hair is nice and clean. Um, I when I got out of the shower, I put it in uh, just a regular white t-shirt, cotton white t-shirt. It keeps it from being super frizzy from like a, a teddy towel, not teddy, Terry, Terry towel. So yeah, so right now I'm just parting my hair into four. I didn't deep condition my hair today. I only do that like every, whenever my hair really needs it. Maybe I should do it often. I don't know. Let me know what you do. I don't really do that. If I, if you think I should deep condition more often, let me know. So, oh, oops. So I'm using Diva Curl. I love Diva Curl um, because I'm mixed and I am white. My hair is not as uh, kinky as my mother's. My hair is. I cut my. I sewed my finger the other day. I don't know if you see it. It hurts. It's, it's like that. Whatever. Forget it. But so. <laughs> Um, because I mixed, my hair is lighter, and it can't it can't withstand all the heavy curly products that are um, that other curly haired people use. And I learned that after using. I was using Cantu for a while, and Cantu was a little, even a little too heavy for me. So right now I'm sec I sectioned my hair, and um, I'm just running the Diva Curl Believe In. This is the Leave In Conditioner Believe In through. I put it in the, in the part area, and then I just run my fingers through it. And then I don't have my wide tooth comb with me because I forgot it at school. Maybe I should buy a new one. Let's try this one. Let's see how the curls look. I don't know how I feel about that one. What do you think? I don't know. I'm gonna put some more leaving fish on the bed. So. One part. Down. So I just like part it in the middle, like throughout the part, just so that it gets everywhere. I'm not
So I'm just running my fingers through with my head upside down so that um, my curls don't just lay flat so that they go up as well. So that's that. Now I'm gonna take my Cantu moisturizing cream and ah, I just got it all over. Okay. I don't use a lot because this is heavier than the Diva Curl Leave-In Conditioner. So I, like this is, I don't know, maybe it is a lot. No, it's not a lot. It's like the size of a nickel. And then I just Run it through my hands. Ew, the hair. And I literally just like I scrunch with this on one side with one hand, flip it, and then I scrunch on this side. And then I go like this. I saw this in a video and I thought that it might help me reduce my the frizz and I remember I put product in my hair because instead of running your fingers through it, you're just putting it in it, you're just flat hands. Yes! So my hair is growing. I don't know, I might cut it. I don't know if I like it. Long. Okay. So that's that. Now I take a diffuser to it and I diffuse it. So I just use a normal diffuser. Um, this one. Me and Natalie. My queen has uh, the same one. I, don't know, I got it at Target. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Let me turn it off. Right. Okay. I haven't diffused my hair in a while. Let me look kind of loud. So I put it on. So I put it on cool. Um, cool and low. do this I get really hot I don't know about anybody else but diffuser makes me so hot dry it's still damp it's always damp I never diffuse it all the way until like until like I can wear it outside um last week my hair was in dreads so I mean about a week ago my hair was in dreads and so my curls are pretty loose looser than usual I feel it always happens whenever I have my hair in braids or um or any type of not out whenever it's not out it gets a little i was thinking about putting i think i might put 
Um, I use shea oil. Shea butter oil. You see here, you don't. Um, it says it protects against damage from chemicals. It's really good. I put it on my eyelashes, and honestly, I feel like it has really helped my eyelashes grow. I'm just gonna put this on where my baby hairs would be because I just feel like my baby hairs go through a lot. Since I do them like every day, it's a lot. I think I'm there. Oh, dripping. Ah. So that's on my roots, and they're definitely gonna thank me for it. So this is this. I'm gonna go get my bonnet. So I have an extra, like a jumbo bonnet um, because when my hair is dry, like towards the end of the week, it gets really big. If you don't believe me, it does. Um, but so I put this, I've, I've found that uh, my hair gets the biggest. So this is a new one. I just bought this one. I left my old one in my dorm. So this is a little, this is nice and tight around my head. But um, I found that it, it works best when I wear my bonnet up when I'm up and what I'm doing stuff. Um, I also when it's the first day. Whenever it's my first day wearing the bonnet, like after I wash it, I take a hair tie and make my bonnet smaller just to condense my curls. I mean, I'm gonna need the space like later on in the week, but just for tonight. And not even for tonight, just for like before I go to bed. When I go to bed, I take it out most of the time, but oh, the curl's loose. Yeah, it just condenses my curls so that when I wake up, the curls are tight, and then, um, and then in the morning I shake them out. Um, so let's see. I think that's all I have for y'all. All right, y'all. I'm gonna go do what I'm do. I'll get back to you in the morning. Good night. So it's morning time. And we're gonna see what this looks like under here. Oh my god! Okay, so after that, it looks, it always looks kind of weird like this. So I just put my head like this and I put my fingers through it and I just shake. Shake them. Shake them loose, shake them loose. And then, so I didn't do my bangs. I usually um, finger curl my bangs, but I don't know, I didn't do them. So these are my bangs without the finger curl, without it. Let me just separate them. Let's see if they look any better. My hair feels so soft. Diva Curl. Um, oh, Diva Curl just makes my hair feel so soft. I love it.
so I'm just separating um, all the big curls, trying not to make them frizzy. Sometimes if um, they become a little puffy at, towards the end, like a not curl, like here, let me just show you an example. Like this one, I just take a little bit of water on my finger so, my, so that my fingertip is wet and I go like this and I just, oh shoot, I just curl it like this and then it will dry um, correctly without the puff at the end. Back away from the camera, from the mirror. So I think it came out really well. I haven't done my hair in a while. Um, I was really nervous to do it for y'all because whenever I try to do my hair, <clears throat> ew, so sorry. It's because I just woke up. <laughs> whenever I try to do my hair, it never wants to cooperate with me. So this is it before I pick it out. So I don't have my pick with me. I um, left it at home. But I would usually take a pick and pick it out and then it would be even better. I'm just gonna take my comb as a backup and just nothing since last night. I just put my hair up and let it dry in that condensed form. I'm telling you because whenever I put that because I put that hair tie in it and made the bonnet smaller, that's why my hair is so condensed. Like my hair, you guys saw how long my hair was. Like my hair was here last night. So yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> So this is me before I style it. I probably won't wear my bangs out. Because I no, for me they kind of look crazy without doing the curls. So I'm probably gonna part it down the middle. <clears throat> and do I have bobby pins. So I have colorful bobby pins that um, I would probably put in my hair. Let's just choose a color. I'll do red today. Thanks for watching. If you want more videos, more hair videos like this, um, let me know. Hit that like button, subscribe if you want to stay updated with all my videos. Thank you so much for watching. I love y'all.